Why should cross and trial grieve me? It's a good question. Why should cross and trial grieve me? Written by Paul Gerhardt in 1653. Translation based on John Kelly, 1876, but is a composite into the English. Why should cross and trial grieve me? Christ is near with his cheer. Never will he leave me. Who can rob me of the heaven that God's Son for my own to my faith has given? Though a heavy cross I'm bearing, and my heart feels the smart, shall I be despairing? God, my helper who doth send it, well doth know all my woe and how best to end it. God oft gives me days of gladness. Shall I grieve if he gives seasons too of sadness? God is good and tempers ever all my ill, and he will wholly leave me never. Hopeful, cheerful, and undaunted, everywhere they appear who in Christ are planted. Death itself cannot appall them. They rejoice when the voice of their Lord doth call them. Death cannot destroy forever. From our fears, cares, and tears it will us deliver. It will close life's mournful story, make a way that we may in her heavenly glory. What is all this life possesses but a handful of sand that the heart distresses? Noble gifts that pall me never, Christ our Lord will accord to his saints forever. Lord my shepherd, take me to thee. Thou art mine. I was thine ere I knew thee. I am thine, for thou hast bought me. Lost I stood, but thy blood free salvation brought me. Thou art mine. I love and own thee. Light of joy, ne'er shall I from my heart dethrone thee. Savior, let me soon behold thee face to face. May thy grace evermore enfold me. Amen. There is a difference in the way the old guys talked about our suffering. All the new prayers that we read are something like this. Lord, please deliver me from this affliction. But our fathers in the faith taught us differently. They said, Lord, teach me to receive this affliction from the hands of your fatherly goodness. T teach me to learn that the troubles that I have in this life are delivered to me by the hands that were nailed to the cross so that we can suffer with, with joy. We can endure pain with gladness. And this hymn from Paul Her Gerhardt really captures that. I hope, it, I hope it brings you some comfort also. I think my cold is getting better, so I had to take advantage of it to read a couple of poems. Maybe I'll try a few more. <laughs> Thanks, guys, for paying attention, for subscribing, for jumping into the conversations. Great. Uh, God's peace be with you.